really well bonded snow all the way up until this loose faceted and then there's that slight soft spot right about here where the shear test failed. We'll see what the ECT test does. It's going to be more of a representative of a rider going across the hill. Nope. So on four, the top layer just compressed. You can see where it broke on the angle. Those facets gave way. I've got fractures here. We'll keep going. Okay, so we failed at four on the top layer. Let's see what that mid layer does after we clean that off. So that was the facets giving way. So that's that loose layer of surface facets we've got to deal with with our new snow. That's what's likely going to pop on us as we're traversing the back country. And let's see if this lower, lowest layer will go. So on the tent that finally did fracture all the way through, but it wasn't a clean slab. You've seen that these facets gave way even with just um, resident vibration over here. So this top layer is very considerable. Um, all you need is, is the slope and the snow and it'll go. Um, so we're going to play it pretty safe and be mindful of our slopes. This is on a 38 degree slope. Um, so that's a good indicator of what we're going to see. So be safe out there. I'll update Utah Avalanche's um, forecast page. Thank you.